are. It's February 13th. I'm doing a bread box solar water update. Looks like the temperature today is 152. Yep, 152. That's the ambient temperature in the box. Now we'll go inside and see if it's warm enough for bathing. It should be. Still have a little bit of moisture in there. I still have to work on figuring out how come the sides are leaking here. Somebody, uh, I read somewhere about going to a roofing company that they have a special. See all this, uh, the caulking that was suggested for the heat is just flaking right off. So it's not doing any good. So I still have to figure out a different uh, sealant for around the top by this glass. Oof, we'll get it. This has all been a big experiment, one thing at a time. But today's the first day. I broke my 150 temperature. I now have 152, so I'm happy as a clam with that. Let's see how the water runs inside. Okay, we're inside, uh, and I'm turning on the water to see if it's shower hot. Oh, yeah, baby, there's hot water right there. that I built. Now I've been in it for a few minutes now, completely shampooed and bathed, and it's just now starting to feel a little cool to the point where I really don't want to be under it. I'm all rinsed off though. you happy days so if I knew uh, if I knew someone who couldn't get a gas into their property or if their gas was turned off and they had to use this as a backup they could certainly use it and this is just the middle of uh, February it's not really even that. It's probably, when I saw the last temperature for, for the temperature outside, it was 46 degrees, but this water is warm enough to, the box said 152, the water was warm enough to bathe in. I would certainly say that this is a success, the bread box water heater, solar, solar water heater. The only thing I'd want to change on it is uh, to uh, make sure that that seam around the top is more watertight and reinforce the lid a little more. So if you're going to make it at home, make sure that you do those two things to address those. I'm going to have to go to a roofing company and look into getting uh, something better than that heat resistant silicon that I used around the top for the glass. Other than that, it works. <laughs> 